Okay. The second step is to move the sequencer close to the main body and make the and make the same level between sequencer and main body. Then we need to uh, centering the one, two, three screws hole to lock the three screws, connect the main body and sequencer. At this moment, we adjust the leveling of sequencer again in X position and for Y position. Level finish, then we go here to lock the three screws. Okay, step three is to connect the screws, but keep keep the screws in tight. Uh, no, keep the screws in in loose. Do not lock the do not lock the screws first. Make sure make sure the panel and sequencer is same level is to uh, install the chain first we need to remove the cover now we install the chain what for chain this this way mm. is this way then we put the chain into the into the reel yes yeah This is a direction. Yes, you can put it slowly. To put the chain slowly. Okay. We move the chain to the paper cutting station. And move out the chain. And here we Move the chain to go through the support base, and we keep moving the chain to the CTA. It's not, it's not easy. You're gonna be careful and slowly. Now the next we. Move the chain to the next uh, gear and go slowly to go through the CTA again. And we're gonna continue to move the chain to the next gear and to the uh, next rail. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, we. Keep moving the chain to put back to this. Okay, we keep moving the chain to go through the first gear and then the second. And keep moving to the last one. And then put that to the reel and keep moving. Keep moving, moving, and moving. Okay, now we're gonna to, uh, connect the chain to the beginning to uh, connect the end. We're gonna to open the spoon first. Take out the spring and take out the second take out the second spring. And we take out the Oh, this is the shaving cool. 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 O
，没事拉紧过来呀。哎，你你不用拉那么紧。嗯。那怎么了 ？Now we can see the the chain is too short. Uh, so we can adjust here. Adjust here to move move the gear a little bit to make the chain a bigger space. Then we back to here. Okay, finally, we install the chain end to end. Now we're gonna to connect the two end of the chain. We install. We install the two pin first, and then we install the carrier. Then we put the spring to the carrier and put the other spring. Also to the carry push. What's that? Now push them here. Then we put the push down. Then we connect the panel in the bottom side. Use a tooling. Press the spring. Here, and and this one is here. We mark. We mark here. There. After we finish the connection here, uh, we must careful. Remember, just now we have just now we have moved the gear to inside. Now we need to turn back the gear. And put put the gear back to make the Correct pressure of tension of the chain. That's it. Okay. Okay. We gonna to connect the cable first. And then, and then the two uh, two cable. We have a, a mark here, Z1 and Z2. And lock the screws. Okay, now we're gonna to connect the cable from the motor to the servo. This is the only one. The connector to the servo. Okay, the second one. Okay, the air, the air hose. Okay. Huh? 